Hello, my name is Dr. Diwan S. Raja. Today I will discuss about hydrocephalus ex vacuo. So, what is that? Hydrocephalus ex vacuo. This is not a hydrocephalus, in fact, not a hydrocephalus. Okay, but there is enlargement of the ventricle, enlargement of the ventricle due to atrophy, due to atrophy of the white matter. Surrounding the ventricle, surrounding the ventricle of the brain. Okay, so in fact, this is not a hydrocephalus because there is no increase in the CA separation. So there is, this is not a hydrocephalus, in fact, no increase in CSF pressure, okay, but enlargement of the ventricle due to atrophy of the white matter surrounding the ventricles of the brain, okay, why this happened? This may be a sequelae of, okay, this, the enlargement, that means the enlargement of the ventricle is a is a sequelae or is a continuation, is a complication of stroke, okay, or, or Huntington disease. Okay, so there is no increase in the pressure of the cerebrospinal fluid but there is increase in the size of the ventricle because the, of the atrophy of the brain tissue surrounding the, the ventricles. Okay. So we have no usual sign symptoms of hydrocephalus due to excessive accumulation or enlargement of the CSF in the large ventricle, okay, and there is no treatment for this, for this excessive accumulation of CSF in the ventricle does not need any treatment, okay, no treatment is required required for the enlarged ventricles okay or we can say no treatment is required for hydrocephalus x vacuum we may treat for the huntington disease we may treat other condition like that uh, we may help the patient to manage his complication of stroke but for hydrocephalus x vacu does not need any shunting operation okay no need of shunting operation okay and that's all about the hydrocephalus x vacu if you like my video please support my channel Please share the information with your friends 
and please subscribe me have a nice day bye now